the Kansas National Organization for Women. I am also a constituent of Sedgwick County, and I'm here to speak about fiscal responsibility. While the creation of jobs has been the stated focus of many of the members of the South Central delegation, I would like to remind those people that these jobs will not be found by passing more abortion restrictions. There are but three abortion clinics within 82,282 square miles of Kansas. Those three clinics are located in Kansas City. So I'd hope that this delegation would, int would not intend to spend any more taxpayer time, energy, and resources focusing on three medical clinics in Kansas. <coughs> Last session, we saw abortion take center stage in Topeka with five different measures passed. Three of them are currently in litigation. Kansas has already spent $476,000 on these cases and they have only just begun to move through this court system. More unconstitutional legislation will be introduced in 2012. I wonder if you will willingly spend your time, your energy, and your resources on these endeavors. Will you sign your names as sponsors on these bills? Will you vote yay, whereby approving wasteful spending? Will Kansas once again become a laughingstock with careless comments such as those made by Representative Pete DeGraff who compared a woman's pregnancy resulting from rape to the inconvenience of a flat tire he did that on the House floor. I have 500 miniature tires here today that came from $5 donations from all over the globe. International press this made. They were outraged by your comments, Representative DeGraff, rightfully so, proving that the pursuit of insulting legislation punctuated by insulting comments makes for a very bad image for this state. It highlights the legislative majority's proclivity for the pursuit of priorities that are outside of mainstream Kansas. I respectfully ask each of you to stand on the side of fiscal responsibility, stand on the side of the women and the children within our state by funding education, creating jobs, and rising above everyday politics by refusing to spend Kansas's time, energy, and resources on this issue of abortion, which should no longer be an issue in this state. Representative DeGraff, will you accept these tires as a reminder that rape is not merely an inconvenience? Here, here is abortion.